we've talked about it quite a bit, but what is the Bank of Canada? The Bank of Canada is a central bank that was established in the 1930s, I think it was 1934, as a private institution. There hadn't been much need for it before that. But then the farmers and, other, and the small business people that were uh, suffering at the hands of the private banks said we should have a central bank. <clears throat> the British set up a royal commission to study it, and it was recommended that we establish a central bank, uh, which they did, as, a, as I say, as a private corporation. Well, then in 1938, um, William Lyon Mackenzie King had taken over as prime minister, and he had a member of parliament by the name of Jerry DeGeer, who had been mayor of Vancouver, who understood what we're talking about. And he talked the prime minister into nationalizing the bank. Without Jerry DeGeer, it would never have been done. And then without Prime Minister William Lyon Mackenzie King, it would never have been done. And if it hadn't been, then we wouldn't be talking about the possibility of using the bank today because we wouldn't own it. But we do own it 100%. All the shares are held by the Minister of Finance on behalf of us, the people, and, uh, and we can use it creatively and should use it creatively. That's what it's there for. And we don't need to use other banks for the federal needs. Um, we can use our own bank because we own it, the Bank of Canada. And uh, it does other things, it helps the private banks and uh, looks after the government's uh, bond issues and this sort of thing. And that's fine, but it should look after us too. And that's what it's not doing now, which it hasn't been doing since 1974. And this is the big, big, big change that we're projecting and saying should be done and done as soon as possible. Mm -hmm. Actually, we keep saying, you know, you should do it before Christmas. You should do it before the house rises in the spring. Well, a couple of springs and Christmases has gone by and they haven't done it yet. And one of these days, uh, it's gonna catch up with them because uh, yeah we're gonna get the word out and the people are gonna be dissatisfied and, uh, and raise the riot. Mm -hmm. All right. And you mentioned that it was an infrastructure bank. So what's that about and everything in the news about an infrastructure bank? Well, the, the infrastructure bank that the present governor, government is proposing is one that would be established especially for infrastructure and it would be some Canadian participation, but a lot of foreign participation as well, which we don't need. And uh, the Bank of Canada was our infrastructure bank from 1939 to 1974. The Bank of Canada could be our infrastructure bank, so we do not need the infrastructure bank that the government of Canada is proposing. It is redundant, it is a backward step, it is paying the rich at the expense of the poor, and just in other words, going down the wrong road, and the time to turn it off is right now before it gets going. <laughs>